I want to show everybody the progress I've been making on my solar. Um, I went with uh, Kesey Air 120s, random series, uh, so 120 watt panels, four per series to make 48 volts. Um, I went ahead and uh, wired me up a breaker box here. It has a fusing in it. Make them safe if you need to to work on them. This right here is on the side of the house. I still gotta either run kind to it right there or leave it as be, I don't know. I also need to run a grounding rod into the ground. It's starting to get cold here in Indiana. We're supposed to have our first frost tonight, so hopefully I can get one in the ground tomorrow. Put it eight foot down and then connect the, this box to it, the solar panel rack to it, and then the inverters will be in the basement. So, but I thought I'd show y'all the wiring progress. Next day or two, I'll be getting a view of the solar on the roof, a little bit more of it. And then we start the, uh, put the grid ties in downstairs for this array. I already have an array running on the garage, uh, 3KW, uh, with some 250 or 225 watt panels running into two trace 3000 watt inverters doing grid tie function. And this is actually, this particular unit is on the front of the house. So, we're getting there. I'm going to add a few more panels also. I'm trying to get up to about 12 to 15 kW. I'm also going to put in a, uh, tie this into my battery bank or put a uh, grid interactive uh, inverter online with this. Run into a battery bank and maybe a few extra panels off this going into that to do uh, battery functions as well. But these right here are strictly going grid tie at the moment. So I'm going to do two different systems or integrate them together. But I figured I'd show you all the progress of how good this looks in here. All my grounds coming off the rack, then going downstairs into the basement, and then all the positives coming off the upper roof. So there you have it.